did they? Did you guys think this is a little bit oh, cruel? Come on, she deserves it. It is not her fault that she has a huge crush on me. Hannah's been making the moves on him. I'm just looking out for my girl, Em. Just because he's class pres doesn't mean he belongs to everyone. Mike is my man. Hey, Em, I'm not anybody's man. <laughs> Whatever you say, darling. this weekend. Josh. Jeez, Josh. <laughs> Once again, brother, you've outdone us oh. all. God, what did our naive sister get herself into now? I got your note. I'm glad you can make it. Maybe we should start with a little, you know, making out and see where it goes from there. Take a joke. It was just a prank, Han. What did you do? We were just messing around, Dad. It wasn't serious. You jerks! Hannah! Hannah! So, should we go after her? You know, I kind of think you're the last person she wants to see right now, Mike.
Hello? Hello? Here, take my coat. I'm such an idiot. I'm so dumb. Hannah, back. Before we begin, there are a few things I need to make sure you understand. You see, no one can change what happened last year. The past is beyond our control. You have to accept this in order to move forward. But there is freedom in this revelation. Everything you do, every decision you make from now on will open doors to the future. I want you to remember this. I want you to remember this as you play your game. Every single choice will affect your fate and the fate of those around you. So, you have committed to commence with this game. This is significant. And I want to help you see it through. Sometimes, Sometimes these things can be a little scary, even terrifying, but I'm here to make sure that no matter how upsetting things may get, you will always find a way to work through it. Hmm? All right, we will start with a simple exercise. Could you please pick up a card? And I want you to look at the picture on the other side and tell me what you feel about it. It, it is essential that you answer honestly in order to get the most out of this experience. So, how did that picture make you feel? Remember, be honest. Okay, honesty is good. What do you think it is that makes you feel uneasy? If it is something you cannot see, then why does it make you feel uneasy? 
I mean, is there something in the house? And this thing in the house, is it a lie? Source of your fear is elusive. <laughs> I'm sorry we're out of time for now, but I want you to think hard about what's inside that house and what it is that makes you uneasy, and we can unwrap it together. One year anniversary of the dreadful tragedy that took place on Mount Washington. Annie Klein was in charge of the investigation. Thanks for having me, Marty. Well, this is an update on Hannah and Beth Washington, the twins who are still missing. One year ago tonight, the Washington girls left the safety of their parents' lodge and headed out into a snowstorm. Foul play. Not officially, no. There is one individual we're considering as a person of interest, but his whereabouts are currently unknown. He has an interesting history with the Washington family. He had warned them against pursuing their construction project and claimed the land was sacred to his forefathers. You know, there is still the old sanatorium on the mountain. Could he be hiding there? My officers did search the grounds, but the girls themselves couldn't have made it that far. Something about that mountain seems to breed tragic events. More than you know, Marty. Well, thank you for joining us, Andy. With all the Washingtons tonight, with their son Josh, on this, the anniversary of the mysterious disappearance of Hannah and Beth Washington. Well, hello, friends and fans. All right, let's do that again. All right. Well, hello, friends and fans. It's beyond awesome to have you guys all back this year. Um, first off, I got to say, I am super excited to welcome all my pals back to the annual Blackwood Winter Getaway. Ah! <laughs> so um, let me just let you know, uh, let's take a moment to address the elephant in the room for a second. I know you're all probably worried about me, and I know it's going to be tough on all of us going back after what happened last year. but. I just want you all to know, um, it means, it means so much to me that we're doing this. And that I know it would mean so much to Hannah and Beth that we're, we're all still here together. And I'm thinking of them. I really want to spend some quality time with e each and every one of you and um, just share some moments that we'll never forget for for the sake of my sisters and, you know. Okay, so let's party like we're fucking porn stars, okay? Make this one trip we will never forget, all right? Yes!
Someone there? What? <sighs> Damn it. Oh, Jesus, never mind. Bella? You hungry? Huh? <laughs> Cutie. <laughs> cool. all the way up here. Chris, are you here? The bag's here, where are you? You're not in the bag, are you? I'm sorry, are, are you my secretary? I was buzzing. Cool, well, thanks for letting me know. I, I can take it from here. Oh, so I found something kind of amazing. What? I'm not going to tell you. You got to see for yourself. Come on, it's this way. Where? Right around here. Going to blow your mind. Think we'll get a visit from America's Most Wanted? Looks like someone thought so. 
Oh, come on. This place is abandoned most of the year. Nobody comes up here. Ta-da. Pretty rad, right? Yeah. Come on. Look at these beauties. Uh, beauties is not the word that comes to mind. Why is this even here? What do you mean? What the hell is a shooting range doing at the base of a ski lodge? Uh, dude, have you ever met Josh's dad? Yeah. He thinks he's like Grizzly Adams or something. Wanna try? Uh, no, you go ahead, Grizzly. All right, here goes. Wow, nice shooting tits. All right, I'm bad. I'm a badass. I'm gonna go ahead and guess it was a wild case of beginner's luck. No, I don't think so, girl. Well, anybody and their brother could shoot a bottle that big, that close. Nice shot. Your ass just got sacked. <sighs> hey, sharpshooter, our ride's coming. Wait, I'm just getting the hang of this. Come on, Chris, the cable car. After a whole year. Yeah, I swear the moment I got here, it just it all came flooding back. Hey, that's weird. The door's locked. Yeah. Uh, Josh wanted us to keep it locked to keep people out. He said that? What people? I, I don't know. He said they found people sleeping in the station one time. It's creepy. That's for you. Oh, real gentleman. was closer. Guess we gotta wait. What a crazy place to set up house. I mean, no matter how rich you are. I'm not so rich. Family bought a mountain. Stay here and catch some Z's, but I... okay. Mm, just like going to the prom. Here we go. Right, adventure begins. Oh, I hope this was the right thing to do. What? You know, getting everyone together on the anniversary. I mean, Josh seemed really pumped about us all doing something, didn't he? Yeah, no, he definitely did. I haven't seen him so excited about something in forever. Good, good. It's hard to tell with him, and I, I don't know, kind of been worried. No, no, it was, it was a good idea. I hope everyone else feels the same way. We're all here, aren't we? Thanks, bro. Good talk. <laughs> you know what? Let's just, let's just stop talking about what happened and enjoy the trip. Uh, you know what, you're right. You know how Josh and I met? No. Okay. Third grade. 
Josh sat in the back of the room, I sat in the front. We didn't even know each other existed, but the kid sitting next to Josh started strap snapping the training bra on the girl in front of him. So the teacher made him move to the front where I was sitting. Okay, so? So I got moved to the back. And? And next to Josh, that's how we met. I mean, and became friends to this day. A match made in heaven. If it weren't for the fact that Jeannie Simmons hit puberty like three years early, and on that day decided to wear a low-cut shirt that showed off her training bra, I mean, who knows? You could be riding in this cable car alone. Right now. Or, or talking to some other person entirely. Boom. Butterfly effect. Stroke? We're stuck in this stupid thing. Can you please let us out? Pretty please? Oh my god. I thought we were goners. Another 10 minutes in there and I would have chewed off my own leg. Oh, sick, Chris. Look, I got a lot of meat on my bones. It's all muscle down here. Yeah, right. Uh -huh. Hey, Chris. <laughs> I'm just doing like Sam taught me. Other people's private thoughts are my own personal playground. Do not be a jerk. My goodness. Seems that someone has a little crush on our good friend and dear class president, Michael Monroe. Chris. And what kind of sizzling erotica might our Jessica be capable of imagining? I wonder. Give that back, you tool. Tool and die. That's my motto. Oh, you're such an idiot. Maybe nosy Nancy shouldn't go nosing around in other people's nostrils. Uh, yeah, I, I try not to do that as a rule. Come on, Jess, you can tell us. You can totally keep secrets. Whatever. You'll figure it out eventually. All right, all right, let's just get up to the lodge already. It's getting tired of all this nature and junk. Uh, you guys go ahead. I'm just gonna wait here for a bit. See who else is coming. You mean Mike? What? I mean, you know, whoever. Uh-huh. Sam? <gasps> Did you see this view? I mean, holy cow. Sometimes I forget to just stop and take it all in. Seriously, couldn't they have built the lodge like right where the cable car ends? I don't think it would have been like as pretty. And where's the bellboy when you need one? <sighs> getting chills. We're almost there. No, I mean, getting kind of creeped out. Oh, uh, yeah. It's gonna be weird seeing everyone up here again. Definitely not gonna feel like a regular party. I mean, what do you think? Ah! Oh, Jesus! <laughs> Guys. Michael! You really, really should have seen your faces right Dude, there. Dude, I almost clocked you just now. <laughs> nice one. Michael, you're a jerk. Come on. Guys, we're all friends here, right? No need for violence, just a little harmless fun. We're up in the woods, it's spooky. Come on, let's get into the spirit of things. The spirit of things? Seriously, what's wrong with you? I'm just trying to lighten the mood, Em. Don't be like that. Like what? The way you're being. You always get like this. Michael, I'm just gonna lay it out. Otherwise, this whole weekend's gonna suck ass for everyone. Um, this is super awkward, and we all know it. Let's just uh, acknowledge it now and move on, okay? Matt. I hear you, man. 
I get it. I don't want to make this weird. Cool. So we're good? All good. You guys gonna make out now? Oh my god, totally. We're so gonna make out. Uh, no. Seriously, I'm gonna go check on the cable car back down the trail. All right. See you, man. See ya. All right. See ya. Oh, crap. What? Hey, could you take these the rest of the way? The bags? Yeah, all the bags. Uh, why? I need to go find Sam. Okay. Sorry, I just, I really need to go find her. I totally forgot I needed to talk to her before we get all the way up there. This really can't wait. We're almost there. It's important, Matt, please. All right, fine. If it's so important, I guess I can pack horse it the rest of the way. But you owe me one. Excuse me? Well, then we're even, at least. I'll think about it. Just be careful. See you up there, sweetie. Thank you. friend zone kind of way. They might need to check the expiration date on their big breakup. Oh! oh God. <laughs> oh. Hey, whoa. Oh. <laughs> Sorry there. Sorry about that, Ash. I didn't mean to scare Just you. Just Louise, Well, Matt. I did mean to scare you, sort of scare you, but not like for real oh scare you. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Hey, well, man, I'm, I'm really sorry, Ash. Damn. It's okay. It's fine. It's what are you looking at? See anything juicy with that thing? Uh, it, Let me check it out. Uh, yeah, it's kind of busted. It's not, it's not like really interesting. It's just. What? <laughs> For real? I, I bet I could find like a cool bear chowing down on a fox or something. Uh, no, really, Matt, it's not worth straining your eyes. I'm getting kind of a headache just from looking through it. So just no, no. All right. Uh, sure, if you say so. Not just do that. Put your hands where I can see them. We've got you surrounded. But who am I to retaliate? What choice do I, a supple young rebel girl, have but to surrender to the strapping military guard come to take me into custody? I, well, I don't know when you put it like that. Hey! <laughs> oh! <laughs> Great. Hey, you know that? <laughs> Where are you hiding, little chickadee? Oh! Ah. Hey! Oh, snap! <laughs> Hello? Come on. <laughs> hey, Mike! Boom! Okay. Oh, you got me. <laughs> you can't hide from me, Michael. I know all your tricks. Oh. That's right. Why don't you just... And then what? Oh, oh. 
No more. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, more. Oh, you're going down. <laughs> gotcha. Done. Done city. So did I go down? Uh, I don't think so. <laughs> I think you'd know so if I did. All right, all right. My, my. So are we calling it my favor then? You're a worthy opponent, Miss Jessica the Snowball Queen. Okay, that sounds vaguely dirty. My lady. Wow. Save some for later, buddy. Endless reserves. <gasps> we should get up to the lodge. Yeah. It's so nice out here, though. Pretty breathtaking. I mean, I could stay out here for pretty much ever, provided I was making out with you the whole time. Just making out? Quote, unquote. Well, I think we might freeze to death somewhere in between those quotes. Yeah. scratched the surface in our last session, so let's go a little bit deeper this time. This time, we're going to try to understand the root of your anxiety. Now pick up that book, turn the pages. You will see a set of pictures and symbols. I want you to identify which image in each set makes you the most anxious. Did that startle you? So sorry. You're doing very well. Don't be nervous. Try to speed up a bit. The more you rely on your instincts, the more honest your answers will be, and the more enlightening you will find this experience. Sounds like a good Friday night. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Well, I'm afraid, once again, we're out of time, but I promise we'll talk again very soon. Think this is a little 
help it. Oh, come on. She deserves it. Hannah! What's going on? Where's my sister going? It was just a prank, Han. First off, I gotta say, I am super excited to welcome all my pals back to the annual Blackwood Winter Getaway. I really want to spend some quality time with each and every one of you and um, just share some moments that we'll never forget for, for the sake of my sisters. I need to go find Sam. Whoa, hello. Somebody's getting a little friendly. So I got moved to the back. And next to Josh, that's how we met. Boom. Butterfly effect. Man, I feel like this mountain gets bigger every time I climb it. Oh yeah? That feels the same to me. Come on, you grew up here. It probably feels like it's shrinking. I guess that's true. When are you gonna install some cell towers up here? I'm getting withdrawals already. You got a spare million lying around, I, I'll fix you right up. Funny you should say that. I, I think I left it in my other jacket. Whoops. Hey, gang. You guys get up here okay? <sighs> Could've done with some bellboys, but uh, hey. Can't get everything. Yeah, it was pretty easy. A little creepy though, I mean, it's just really weird being back here. Yo, yo, yo. We get things moving up here or what? Yeah, man. Hey, you doing all right? I mean, I know it must be really tough without your sister. Stop. I just meant that. No, I know what you meant. You know, seriously, I'm over it. And I just I want us to have a good time, you know? Like we always used to. Damn it. It's a freaking thing. It's iced. What else? Maybe there's another way in. There are a million ways in, they're just all locked. There's gotta be like a window around the corner we can get like, get open or something. Wait a second, are you saying we should break in? <laughs> I don't think it's technically breaking in if you own the place, right? Hey, not if I don't report you. Um, <laughs> lead the way, coaches. Hey, Ash. Hi, Chris. So, how are you doing? Good, but a little cold. I think I could use some time curled up by the fire. Yeah, that does sound pretty nice. without your helmet and jersey. Yeah, been a tough one. Good to see you. So how's it hanging? Pretty good, man. Can't complain. You? Oh, you know, same old, same old. Cool. doing? She's fine. Why? No worries. She's like a sleeper hit kind of gal, you know? And I just want to rip that parka right off of her and make some snow angels, right? 
Huh. Absolutely. When are you gonna take her to the bone zone? <laughs> like that could ever happen. Come on, man. She practically spends her entire life with you as it is. Well, yeah, but we're like friends. Listen, dude, look around you. Look at these beautiful mountains. Do you see any parents? I mean, can you imagine a more perfect, ripe scenario just dripping with erotic possibilities? You and Ashley alone at last. You've laid all the groundwork. You've been a perfect gentleman. Now, you come in for the kill. Maybe you're right. You're a hunter, bro. No fear, no mercy. I mean, she won't even know what hit her. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right, I got it. Jeez. So, how are we planning on breaking into my parents' lodge, bud? I didn't say I had a plan. You sounded like you had a plan. You better deliver, Koshis, or else you got four lovely ladies who are gonna be freezing their buns off. And last time I checked, that's not a good way to get laid. Oh, shoot, nobody likes cool buns. Hmm. Well, 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 we got ourselves a thinker. Nice one. more attention in climbing class. You mean Jim? Yeah, you know, with the climbing up the rope. Whoa. Did I do that? I, I don't think so. Here, use this. Whoa, Chris, I just got an awesome idea. Yeah? Totally. What, what is it? Okay, so... I'm pretty sure that I've got some deodorant in one of the bathrooms. You could use that with the lighter. I, I don't follow. How's, it, how's a stick of deodorant gonna help? Spray on. It's a can. Oh, yeah. Now I gotcha. Flamethrower. Just like we did with the little army dudes. Yep. Ones we melted. Just point the spray can in the lighter and whoosh. Bye-bye frozen lock. Bingo. All right, so you got this. I'm gonna go sort something out. You up for hunting around in the dark for a little bit? Nope, but I'll do it. Godspeed, Pilgrim. What was that? Whoa! 
Hi, Chris. Very funny. Oh, how'd you know it was me? Shouldn't you be, like, getting the lock open or something? On it. Freezing our buns off out here. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I'll, I'll be here all week. <laughs> ah, crap, that thing freaked me out. What was it? Are you okay? It's like a bear or tiger or something. Oh, it was just a cute little baby Wolverine. Baby? Don't worry, buddy. You're gonna be a big boy soon. Home sweet home. Sweet is not the word I'd use. Oh my gosh, it's so good to be inside. Even if it's still kind of freezing in here. I'll get a fire going. 
This place barely looks any different. Yeah, nobody's been up here. Even with all the police coming in and out? N not a lot of action up here lately. Nope. What's up, party people? Hi. Hey. Hey. Hey, man. Make yourself at home, bro. We'll do. Oh my god, that is so gross. <laughs> Are you trying to swallow his face whole? Um, I mean, seriously, can she be any more obvious? No one wants in on your territory, honey. Excuse me? Did you say something? Oh, did you not hear me? Was your sluttiness too loud? Sounds like someone's bitter she didn't make the cut. Yeah, it's all a big cattle call with that dream boat. Congrats, you're top cow. That's real deep calling Miss Homecoming a cow. You're making everyone uncomfortable, Jess. Jealous much? Emily too frigid for you too. Hey, that's that's uncalled. Look, whatever. I don't give a crap what you think. At least I can think. 4.0, bitch. Honor roll. Suck on that when you're trying to sleep your way into a job. Who needs grades when you've got all the natural advantages you can handle? Oh, please. You couldn't buy a moldy loaf of bread with your skanky ass. <laughs> Are you serious? Do you think that's insulting? That bitch is on crack or something. Emily, stop. This is out of hand. There's no reason to fight like this. Yeah, Em. Why are you picking fights over your ex-boyfriend, huh? Stop it! This is not why we came up here. This is not helping. It's not what I wanted. If we can't get along for 10 minutes, then maybe we need a little bit of a break, right? Mike, why don't you check out the guest cabin, the one I told you about? Yeah. Yeah, all right. Want to go do that? Any place without that whore. It's right up the trail. Well, that's over. Yeah. So, Josh, uh, should we get this fire going? Where's my bag? Huh? My bag, the the little bag with the pink pattern, the one I got on Rodeo. Matt, are you are you listening? Oh my god, don't you remember? Next to the Italian shoe place where I got the stilettos and you knocked over the rack while you were drooling all over that girl at the counter? Well, I mean, she was asking about my letter jacket. Right, because she gave a shit about your designer letter jacket. Why do you hate my jacket? Matt, I need my bag. Oh my god, Em, you, maybe you just forgot it. Do you seriously think I'd forget my bag? Well, do I... Do you? Guess not. You must have left it down by the cable car station. <sighs> Come on, hon. We'll be back soon. And then we can get warm? We can get very warm. Okay. Okay, let's go. Okay, I'm gonna go take a bath. Exiled. Sexiled. <laughs> Works for me. Oh, bar. How far is this cabin anyway? This cabin is the coziest, most romantic love den you will ever lay your eyes upon. <laughs> if we ever make it. I have a feeling luck's on our side. Play your cards right and maybe you will get lucky. Hey, porn stars! You're gonna need these. Porn star? I paid to see you. Uh, gross. Hey, I'm sorry to kick you out like that. No worries, man. Oh, I'm sure you'll find a way to entertain yourselves. Mm-hmm. You have fun with the peanut gallery. <sighs> oh, I almost forgot. You gotta fire up the generator so you can see where you're going. It's dark out there. All right, roger that. I think Josh was flirting with me. Okay. You want to invite him up with us? Wait, really? What? No.
hot lips. Photo booth. All right, read my mind. Okay. Oh my god. <laughs> this is perfect. We're like the cutest couple. Damn. You should be a model. You keep that camera handy, and maybe I'll let you start my portfolio at the cabin. Wink. Noted. <sighs> Burr, it is freezing out here. Now that's something I can help you with. And how are you gonna do that? Uh, I got a few things in mind. Emily's as dumb as she looks if she thinks she can cut in on what we got going on. Maybe if we're lucky, she'll try and follow us out here and get eaten by a bear. I think you bring out the worst in her. Is that so? Epic jealousy. Suck it. Huh. Guess this thing needs juice or something. Didn't Josh say there was a generator? Mike, wouldn't it be nice to buy our pussy and get moving? Jenny! Boom. Nice one, Mikey. Woo! You are a wizard. Damn, the gates shall open. Pretty good, right? Yeah, totally. That was just awesome. Oh, yeah. I bring the hits. <laughs> you psyched yet? You don't look psyched yet. I am so psyched right now. <laughs> it's like a little adventure, a sexcapade. Wow. From Hannah and Beth. I think they'd clean it up. Well, they never closed the investigation. Okay, I'm getting the creeps now. Well, whoever they are, I'm sure they're happy we're all thinking about them. That's a nice way of thinking about it. Hear that? I heard something. Yeah. Damn. I don't think we can get up to the cabin with a path block like this. Oh, no way am I going back to the lodge, aka Wax Museum, to drink hot chocolate with Emily. You know what? Fuck it. We're adventurous. Ah! Ah! Jess! Fuck! Hey, Jessica! Yep. Hey. I'm okay. Holy crap, you scared the heck out of me. How do you think I felt? Uh, you didn't hit your head or anything. As far as I can tell, I still have all seven of my limbs. 
Uh, yeah. Can you get out? I... I don't know. I can hardly see anything down here. All right, coming after you. Just stay put. Hey, handsome. Want to help me move this cart thing? All right. How am I moving? How am I moving? Imagine just grunting together. This is not what I pictured. the good kind of willies. Can I offer you a little comfort and reassurance? <laughs> we'll save it for the cabin, Buster. This is like historical. Holy bat cave. It's gotta be Native American, right? I don't think the miners were getting there. <laughs> you alright? Yeah. Close one. I don't think this place is up to code. Yeah, I'm thinking it's time to go. Fixer rubber. Finally, a little ray of hope. Josh said cabin, I felt like Abe Lincoln. <laughs> <laughs> what 
Wait till you see the Lincoln bedroom. Oh, are you planning on getting presidential on me? Uh, I'll take a ride on Air Force One. <laughs> all right, all right. Save it for the stump speech, buddy. Ooh, a telescope. Gonna look at the trees, gonna look at the clouds, gonna look at the cabin. Um, whoa. You all right? I just saw someone at the cabin. Okay. Let me see. Hey, Jess. Mm-hmm? Stay close by, okay? What's up? Uh, this posting says there's some brown bears up here sometimes. Oh, Michael, I have the best idea. What? Let's go hug a bear. Come on, please. Come on. Let's not hug a bear. <laughs> Josh, could you have at least cleared out the path before sending us up here? <laughs> really? What? I didn't figure you for the glass half-empty type. You got a better idea? Stand back, Debbie Downer. <laughs> oh, boo! Show off. Hey, Mike. You've got something on your face. Ah. Boo! Okay. Okay. That's how it's gonna be. Yes? Yes! Sammy! What? You wanna help me get this fire going? Uh, well, I was just getting into the bath. Oh. Oh, do you need any help with that? Hardy R. Come on. All right, Josh, let's see if you know how to hook up the hot water in your big fancy lodge.
crash much. Those things are a joke, man. They don't do shit. No way, bro. I mean, we used to do it all the time, me and... Well... Josh, no hot water's kind of major oversight, don't you think? Yeah. Ooh, yeah, you just gotta fire up the boiler. It's in the basement. All right, you guys see if you can find the spirit board. Chris, let's go find it. It'll be like a scavenger hunt. Um... Okay. Guess so. Brad. You're not gonna regret it. You up for a ride along? how I gave Chris and Ash a mission together. Yeah, I was thinking they could use some alone time. They are very sweet together. I wish they'd just freaking get on with it already. I swear, they just need, like, something to bond over, you know, some sort of traumatic event to send them into each other's arms. I mean, at this rate, they'll be in the geriatric ward before Chris makes a move. <laughs> You know, Sam. Yes, Josh? I just wanted to say... Uh, what? It really means a lot to me that everyone came back this year and you know that you came, Sam. Josh, we're here for you. Really, whatever you need, whenever, we're all gonna make it through this, together. Um, I want us to have a good time, you know? Hey, watch your step. I think I can handle a little old set of stairs. Mm -hmm. Sorry to drag you down into the bow. Oh, just get me some hot water and I'll be super fine. I mean, I wouldn't want you coming down here on your own, you know? Well, it's definitely creepy down here. Yep. Not a place to be on your own. Pretty rough playing baseball out in all that snow. No, it, it wasn't in the winter, silly. I mean, we'd come up in the summer and we would have the best time. The whole family was there. Mom, Dad, my sisters. It was some serious competition out there on the big lawn. I don't know. Can't go back. 
new reality. Right, Sam? Anyway, I'm supposed to be fixing this whole guy, right? Here, can you, can you hold this? What's that? What was what? Just shine it here so I can see what I'm doing. Hey, can you just keep the light so I can see, okay? Sam, please. Nice one. Okay, first things first. We gotta increase the water pressure before we get the boiler fired up. Mmm, sounds kinda complicated. No, it's actually pretty simple. It's okay. I'm just try again. Oh. That's more like it. <laughs> All right. Five, girl. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> about it. Maybe we should you know, check it out. Why? I don't know, what if it's like a, a pipe that's about to burst or some problem with the furnace? Unlikely. If it were me, I wouldn't want this place to burn down on my watch. Yeah, right. Was I not supposed to take advantage of the opportunity? Are you... are you serious? 
Were you in on this, putz? <laughs> no, but I, I wish I was. That was too good. I'm ready to admit that your dumb little prank may have a slight whiff of humor. Joke master. Well, I, I said nothing about jokes. I said your prank, which was dumb. Holy crap, you were scared. Admit it. I was not. Come on, you totally pissed yourself. Josh. What in God's name are you wearing? I found my true calling. Mm -hmm. Please tell me you're gonna take a vow of silence. <laughs> okay, okay, did you at least find the thingy? Here's our one-way ticket to the spirit realm. You know what? You know what? No, no. I've just been through enough spooking for one night, okay? I see a hot bath in my crystal ball. Mm. All right? So have fun. Oh, but watch out for that, Josh. He's a schemer. Okay. Hello, Earth Matt. You gonna come with me to get my bag? Yeah. Yeah, I'm coming. Madam? Why, thank you, sir. Hey, M. Yeah? Feeling a little better now? Say what? That was a nasty fight. The further we get from Jessica, the better I feel. I just want you to relax. You know? Have a good time. I'll relax when everyone else relaxes, but thanks for trying. You, uh, trying to get me somewhere private? Why don't you, uh, come find out? Matt? Yeah? Thanks for helping me find my bag. I know I can be a little high maintenance. It's no problem, babe. But you gotta remember, there's more to this guy than just being a lean, mean, luggage-lifting machine. You gonna back that up? All day. <laughs> what? All day. <laughs> Wait, what does that mean? Like, all day long. I was being, like, sexy. Nice to be here with you, muscle man. Uh, I'm not all muscle. <laughs> there are some brains in here, too. Well, you got enough brains to like me, so let's see that brawn. You ever done it outside before? Outside of what? My car. I like your car. Roomy. This ain't roomy enough for you? Uh, 
Uh, you know what? Maybe there's a better spot. Does this spot start with a G? There are lots of places out here. I already started clearing this off for us. Like a gentleman. Oh, come on, let's look around. What's so important in the bag, anyways? It's just my undies. The lacy ones. Well, why didn't you say we were scooping up such precious cargo? Andale, andale! <laughs> Whoa, Nelly didn't realize it was so important to you. Didn't, did, uh, hello? <laughs> Why do you think I'm even on this silly trip? Okay, well, now I know the secret to getting you to do what I want, when I want. Duly noted. No secret, true fact. Look at the sexy kisser on this thing. Dare to put your hand in it. Day, I wouldn't. Just. Slide it up in there. Ah! <gasps> Emily! Emily! <laughs> gotcha, big dip. Jesus, you're ridiculous. Oh, come on. What was that? Uh, I'm not sure. Probably just an animal. Do not like Madam. Thank you. Oh my, very impressive. Me neither. Oh! Matt! What the hell's going on? What the hell did this? You know, I'm kind of not giving a shit about my panties anymore. I kind of just want to split. Agreed. I'd like to understand your feelings toward people of fear, isolation, loneliness. Do you share this fear? Is that so? Because that's not reflected in the way you are playing your game. How is it? Investigate your feelings toward other people in greater depth. What you value, what you respect in yourself and others. Which would you 
say was most important in a person? Loyalty or honesty? <laughs> so you would tell a lie in order to be loyal to a friend, okay. And what about loyalty versus charity? Yeah. <laughs> so you would sooner look after your friends before caring for those in greater need? Well, once again, I'm afraid we're out of time. We'll talk again soon. Today is the one-year anniversary of the dreadful tragedy of Hannah and Beth Washington, the twins who are still missing. I know it would mean so much to Hannah and Beth that we're, we're all still here together, and I'm thinking of them. Whoa, hello. Somebody's getting a little friendly. Boom. Butterfly effect. Excuse me? Did you say something? Oh, did you not hear me with your sluttiness? Stop it! Mike, why don't you check out the guest cabin, the one I told you about? Yeah. yeah, all right. Did you hear that? What in God's name are you wearing? Here's our one-way ticket to the spirit realm. Watch out for that, Josh. He's a schemer. Well, that's how it's gonna be. Jess? <coughs> Jess! So, it says here, to communicate with the spirit world, you must free your mind of all preconceptions, drop all inhibitions, and generally give yourself over entirely to the will of others, sublimating your every desire to the whims of the spirit master, which is me. It doesn't say that. And all present will remove their garments at my sole discretion. Chris, come on, this is serious. <laughs> oh, I'm deadly serious. <laughs> oh, shush it. Let's try this. Yes, please. Okay, then. Let's see what happens. Ashley, since... You're a recent convert. Why don't you be our medium for today? Okay. Um, is anyone there? Will you reveal yourself to us if you're there? <laughs> Wait a minute. Did you do that? I didn't do anything. It's moving again. <laughs> H? What's it spelling? Hold on. How's this happening? Are you moving it? I swear, it's just moving. Holy oh, shit. Help? How are we supposed to help? I don't know. What does it mean? We need to know who it is if we're supposed to help them. Who are you? Oh, oh here it goes. Okay, S. I. S. T. E. R. Sister. Sister? Who's sister? Oh, come on, is this for real? Shut up! Ask it who's sister. Josh, it's, it's gotta be. Yeah, okay, well, which sister is it then? Ashley, ask who it is. Who are we speaking to? Hannah? Is that you? Oh, God. <laughs> this is messed up. Josh, are you? I'm fine. Are you sure? Because we can stop. No. Dude, it, it's cool. I want to hear what it says. I don't know where to start. Think about it. If this is actually Hannah, I mean, we can find out what happened that night. Josh? I can handle it. Okay. Um, let me think. Hannah, we miss you. And we want to know what happened to you. Can you, can you tell us what happened? B? E? Like this. Betrayed. What does she mean? Oh, it, it's still going. Oh God. K I L L E. 
Dee? No! Kill. We didn't kill them! It was just a prank! A Ash, calm, calm down, okay? Just, we, we, we need to find out more. I'm sorry, I am guys, so guys, sorry! What, what do they mean? Ask them what, what happened. It's, it's, the, it's the only way to know. Ask them, Ash. Okay. Who killed you? Hannah, who was it? L? I? B? The library. Maybe there's something in the library e here? R? O? O? Proof. There, there's, there's proof. In the library? Oh, no! Ah! Holy shit. Chris? You know what? No, this is bullshit. This isn't real. Josh, I don't know what's going on. Listen. I don't know. I don't know if you think messing with me is somehow going to help me deal with my grief or whatever, but this is not cool. Josh, no! You wanted to use the spirit board! Hey, hey calm down. It's it's not actually. I don't need this right now, okay? You guys are full of it. Should we go after him? Ah, man, I'm... I mean, he'll be okay. Let's... Let's just give him some time. I don't blame him. That was crazy. The pointer flew right off the table. I mean, if, if, if you were faking it, if you were doing one hell of a job. I wasn't faking anything. I think we should do what it says. We should look in the library. Yes? <coughs> Jess! Yes. Where did you go? This is not funny. Jess! Buddy, you in there? Ah! Whoa! Christ! <sighs> I scared the blue out of my jeans. <laughs> what the hell is that doing in there anyway? Jessica, oh, come on. <laughs> yes? Hun? Light of my life? Seriously? This is not funny. I totally promise I won't murder you when I no! Oh my god! No. <laughs> that was so good! Not, no! <laughs> wait, 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 you have to see this. You have to I'm not look, seeing it! No! No! no, no, no. <laughs> you recorded that? <laughs> look at your face! <laughs> I was scared, oh Jed. You can't just jump out at somebody. I'm in the middle of the woods. It's scary. I'm sorry, it didn't I'm, scare you. If we send that to anybody, <gasps> I'm what? gonna kill you. I didn't know you had such a cute little lady like scream, Michael. <laughs> Guess you never really know someone until you've scared the pants off of them. <laughs> All right, fine. You win. It's not a contest. But I do win. Every time. Uh-huh. Whatever you say, babe. <laughs> oh, keep on crying, Romeo. See where it gets ya.
real winter wonderland out here now. Hey girl, you know I'll help you up. Michael. Wait, what? The cabin. I love it. Yeah. Underestimate my culinary jobs. make this quick for you, okay? Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, okay. Uh, geez, how do I... Uh... I can't watch this. Okay, okay, okay.
go! I am! <sighs> Mike, get the key! Get it open! <gasps> Come barging in, I promise. How can you be sure? Because I'm pretty sure bears don't know how to open cabin doors. I've seen them open car doors. What? Where? On the internet. Really? Okay. Well, this isn't the internet, Jess. Right? This is real life. And I promise you that no bear or anything else is going to open that cabin door. I guess you're right. Okay. I'm almost feeling relaxed again. Almost. Huh. Typical. Urgh. This is not the cozy chalet I was promised, Mike. Yeah, it's a bit drafty or something, right? Well, there is a fireplace. Well, we don't need a fire to heat things up. Michael, I am a lady, and a lady needs a proper romantic setting. Okay. A lady would like to cuddle up with her man by a nice cozy fire bathed in atmospheric mood lighting. Right. It'll get plenty toasty once we're rubbing up against each other. My yeah. fire and mood lighting. Yes, my lady. Nice. This will lighten up the mood a little. Oh! Ah! Hey, what, are you okay? What are you doing? It's, it's the lights. I know it's the lights, dummy. You broke them. But it's probably faulty wiring or something. You've got faulty wiring. These guys were inventive. Whoa. I'm not sure if I'm ready for such advanced levels of game play. in there, Mike. Come on. <sighs> well, this will take care of the mood lighting. friendly neighborhood terror bears. That does not make me feel any better. Oh, Jess, look at this. Is it a fire? No, way cooler. Huh? They like me now. Why do guns make men go completely bonkers? Nothing. Right. I shall never understand what we have together. Shit. Fuck, 
Mike. What? Oh, crap. What? Where is it? What? What's wrong? Gone. It is gone, OK? Just slow down. What is gone? My freaking phone, Sherlock. Can you find it? Crap, no. I must have dropped it outside. Oh, shit. I can't lose my phone. My parents will kill me. You can always get a new one. That's like my fourth one this year. OK, OK. Well, I'll have you look for it. It's got to be outside. Yeah, I don't think we want to go out there right now with the bear or whatever it is. <sighs> Fine. I just wish you hadn't gotten me completely soaking wet trying to scare me. Kind of a dick move. I'm sorry, Jess. Probably fell out in the water and doesn't even work anymore anyway, so whatever. Hey, I'll make it up to you. I promise. Looky, looky. Who's gonna fire up some nookie? You've been dying to use that line since we got here, haven't you? One, fire zero. Very nice. Bravo. All right, my lady. What comes next? I think... Well, I, I wish we had some booze. Uh, well, uh, if I'd known that ahead of time. I don't know. I'm kind of just... I'm not feeling it yet. Am I doing something wrong? No, 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 no. I mean, I thought you were one way, but you're kind of another way. Does if that make sense? It's, it's not your fault. Uh, Jess, I really like you. Whoever you think I am, well, just give me a chance, and I will show you what you need. Well, I am liking your confidence. Mike, the shutters. What about them? Um, close them, please? <laughs> There's just no one out there. I feel like someone's watching us. I don't like it. Yes, really. It's fine. <laughs> I really don't like it. Okay, shutter it is. Shutters are shutted. Now, where were we? I'm sorry. I, I'm sorry. I think I'm a little freaked out, and it's hard for me to, like, keep this up and... What? Keep, keep what up? Look, I act all super confident and like a total sexy babe and everything, but underneath, I gotta be honest, I am really kind of insecure. You've got to be kidding me. What? You have nothing to be insecure about. Oh, <laughs> you have no idea. Sure I do. You're just like me and everyone else. We're all insecure. But you know how to handle yourself. You might call it a front, but it's real. Yeah, I guess I do. Yeah, and that's super fucking hot. Really? Yeah, hell yeah it is. Come here. Maybe I know how to handle you too. I am definitely ready to be handled.
What is that? I don't know. Okay, well, go find out now, please. It's your phone. What? How is it my phone? I don't know, it just came through the window. Oh, for fuck's sake, god damn it. What? Those goddamn assholes probably followed us out here to fuck with us and just when we were getting down to business. <sighs> they were if I wish they weren't. I guess we should find out. Josh looked really freaked out at the seance. Yeah, I mean, he, he looked like he was keeping it together, but... Do you think we shouldn't have mentioned his sisters? I mean, it's why we came back up here. Yeah, but not to, like, have a seance. Maybe we went too far. That's a good question. Should I push it? That's what buttons were for, I guess. Whoa, that'll open. That explodes. Are we, like, in a movie right now? If we are, I hope it's a rom-com. Leave it to the Washingtons to have secret passages in their house? I mean, maybe they didn't even know. This place is super old. So, should we take a look? Yeah, after you. No, 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 no. You go. <sighs> Gee, thanks. Whoa. What? Whoa, is what this... What did you find? Holy cow. No, Ash, I, I, I don't want to freak you out, but, but look at this. What? Chris, what is that? I, I think this might be what the spirit board wanted us to find. The clue? Yeah, it's a letter. Let me see it. It's a, a threat. Chris, this is serious. We need to find Josh right now.
What was that? Do you think someone was actually after Hannah and Beth? If so, that would be really messed up. Looks like it was written by Josh's mom. Yeah, she's really making an effort to set things right with some native tribe or something. Yep, the bad karma goes back a long way. So, um, I've just been thinking about something I saw earlier with Sam. What? That there was like this wanted poster, like full on Western style, you know? So? And Sam really thought there was someone following her around. So, so what you're saying, there's some criminal up on the mountain with us? There was a message on this answering machine I found, and it, it, it was from this sergeant saying that there was this guy who had just gotten out of prison and there was nothing he could do. Well, what do you mean? He was saying it like, like a warning. I mean, maybe that's whoever was down in the basement before. What? Under the floorboards in the library, the light. Well, there was that guy I told you well, about. Wait, 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 what guy? The guy who threatened the Washingtons. I mean, he, he said he wanted to take revenge by burning the whole place down. And then I found that crazy psycho letter. Chris, if this is your way of trying to make me feel better, you're fired. <gasps> you hear that? That was Josh! Coming from the kitchen. <gasps> Josh! Josh! <gasps> coming! Hold on! I'm gonna... Ash? Ash? I'm going to show you some uh, pictures of people that you have come to know. But maybe you don't like them as much as you pretend to. Well, this is an exercise in honesty. Tell me which person from each pair you like the most. Take your time, your answers are important. Just a little bit like. No. 
Once again, I'm afraid we're out of time. We'll talk again soon. There is one individual we're considering as a person of interest. He has an interesting history with the Washington family. Apparently, he had warned them against pursuing their construction project in Blackwood Pines and claimed the land was sacred to his forefathers. S. I. S. T. Sister? Ask it whose sister. Josh, it's, it's gotta be. Which sister is it then? Ah! Run! Oh. Oh. oh my god. Ash! Maybe I know how to handle you, too. Oh, fuck! Oh, fuck! What the fuck? Jessica! Oh, my God! Oh, my God! Jess! Jess!
God! No, Jessica! Oh, God! Jess! Jess! Are you okay? Help! Out there, Ashley?
Oh shit. Ashley! Red! Uh, Ash, I'm here. Where are you? Um, I don't know. Are you okay? What, what the hell happened? Please, help me. Uh, I'm coming, Ash. <gasps> Thank you all for joining me. Tonight, we're going to conduct a little experiment, sort of test. Now for this experiment, we'll need the cooperation of our two test subjects, Joshua and Ashley. But we're going to need one more brave participant to help decide which subject will live and which will die. Please, from here. You may need please, please, everyone calm down. It's all very simple. Christopher, you will find a lever placed directly in front of you. All you have to do is choose who you will save. Oh, no. Please, just get me out of here. Shit, shit, no! Oh, okay, 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 this is gonna be okay. Oh, dude, buddy. Oh Let's just think God. about this for Chris, a minute. You can't let me die. Just give me a second. I, 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 uh, huh? I can't think straight. Just, just... huh? Josh, what, dude? You said Wait, not right what? in front of us, man. 
What are you talking about? There's a maniac. Maniac? Oh my god, we gotta get out of here. I don't understand what happened. There's a maniac. There was a sign. It was either him or Ash, and I I don't know what to do. It came right through my head, spilling out fucking everywhere. What? Oh my god, Chris. What? I I killed him. What, Chris? I I, I killed him. It was my fault, man. No, no, this is insane. We need to go get some help. We go right in half. We're gonna figure this out. <laughs> Matt, we need to go get help now. <laughs> Chris, she's right. And who knows who'll be next, right? We just gotta go. Yeah, yeah, it's the only sane thing to do. We'll go get help. No, you just wanna save yourself. No, I just don't wanna make hasty decisions that get everyone killed. You can get everyone else together and I'll go get help. With Matt, right? Uh... Okay. Getting what they deserve. I'm trying to help you in this game you're playing. You understand that it's not good for you, it's not good for anyone. And I can't say that you're showing much loyalty in the way you're playing. Here's our one-way ticket to the spirit realm. I've just been through enough spooking for one night, okay? I see a hot bath in my crystal ball. So have fun. Oh, oh, you do this! Jessica! Oh my god! Oh my god! Shit! There is one individual we're considering as a person of interest, but his whereabouts are currently unknown. You know, there is still the old sanatorium on the mountain. Could he be hiding there? That's not good. That's really not good. Damn it. <laughs> 
Wouldn't I end up in the creepiest place on planet Earth?
That's weird. I just forced them all out. snooping around this paradise.
feeding them?
believe Josh is dead. I can't believe how he died. No, I, I mean, what if they were wrong? What? Maybe we should have checked the shed to see if it was really true. I, I don't know. There are some things that once you see them, you can never unsee them. Yeah, I guess, but some things you have to see for yourself. I'll take their word for it. Paint? It's still fresh. Break the door down, will ya? Whoa, wait a second. When I start smashing shit down, he's gonna hear us. Well, you got any better suggestions? I don't know. What about... Look! What? A window. That's great, Matt. I can just about fit my lip balm through that little slot. No, come on. You will never fit through there, big guy. Okay, fine. Here it goes. I'm gonna huff, and I'm gonna... Shh, just do it! to Chris and Ash and Josh? He's gotta know this is the only way back. Don't say that. Look, the cable car's all the way out there. Well, that's, I, I mean, that's not far, right? You, you can jump it? <laughs> I'm good, Em. But not that good. Flattered, though. Well, Matt, if you can't jump that, what are we gonna do? I, I don't know. God, everything is, like, so busted up. I think they knew exactly what they were doing. Great. No keys, no cable car. So, back to square one. Matt, we, we need another plan. We can't just sit around and do nothing. Very friendly. Unfollow. really did a number on this joint. Such a mess. This place was barely in working condition before, and now? Hey, look. Fire tower. Huh. Maybe that old fire tower will have, like, a, a radio or a phone or, or something. It might. Well, it's not like we have any other options. Probably, yeah. Matt, we gotta get to that radio! We can use the radio to call for help. Somebody's got to pick up the signal. Wow, Matt. Good call. Radio. So smart. Why are you being so bitchy? We're in a serious situation Whoa, here. Well, Matt. Easy. Buddy. And 
just like magic. Come on down. We can totally get out of here this way. You're all right. Yeah. Uh, thanks. Maybe um, you should go first to protect me. Okay. Okay, easy now. Gosh. Okay. Almost. Almost. I'm feeling kind of faint. Don't look down. Whoa. Okay. Okay. Holy cannoli, thank God that's over. Yeah, for real. Climb down. Climb down what? The mountain. Are you serious? What's the big deal? It, it's not like it's floating in the sky. <laughs> it might as well be. It's pitch black out. Hey, hopefully we won't have to. You think the psychopath is just going to give up and run away? No. But maybe we should find a safe spot. Hold up. Wait it out. It, it'll be a lot easier to figure this all out in the morning. As long as we don't hide in the lodge, that's where he expects us to go. I thought the police, like, swept the whole area. Well, it looks like they missed this. Plummeting to my death off a snowy cliff top.
Hello? Guys? What are you doing out there? Being creepy? Okay. Okay, it was all very funny. Haha. -ha. Look at Sam walking around in a towel, but now I just really want this to be over. All right? You had enough? So, what do we have here? out in a towel for the rest of the weekend. Towel it is then. Okay, if you were trying to freak me out, guess what? You succeeded.
Are you kidding me? No handle? Well, that certainly didn't go according to plan, now did it? Such careful, brilliant plotting, and yet in a crucial moment you are foiled by your own inadequacies. I told you that everything you do has consequences. Do you think this mistake won't have repercussions? What you do and what you say causes things to change. Oh, the good work we did exploring the source of your fear. And you've just gone and used it for ill. Mm -hmm. Your overwhelming fear of isolation. You have turned it against these people who you so desperately want to torment. Has it been worth it? We gotta get out of here. I don't understand what happened. There's a maniac. This is insane. We need to go get some help. Hello? Guys? Hello, Samantha. Looking for me? We should look for the others. Mike and Jess are off 69ing each other, and who knows where Sam is. I think she's in the lodge. Why are we still talking about this? Let's go! Hey, look! Fire tower. What is that? I don't know. <gasps> that? What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? Stay calm. Relax. You're just deer. I just want to check us out as all. No, 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 Matt. They're gonna hurt us.
If we do manage to get someone on the radio, we will. Then we tell them we need help. What do we do while we wait? We go back to the lodge and get everyone else. Oh God, not the lodge. We should stay here in case whoever it is needs to get back in touch with us. Let's get that radio working first. It's just a security light. Motion sensor, probably. Disappearances start making more sense. Oh, come on. Great, no power. Gotta be a switch or something around here. Someone who's not a psychopath. Yeah. Yeah, here we go! Nice work. 
Beth. Ugh. <sighs> 
I'm coming. Here. Oh, oh, oh. I don't want to tip it. She wasn't up there? I don't know, I didn't see her. She must have come down here. I haven't seen her either. <laughs> Did that just happen? Damn it, what is going on around here? Chris. Sam, what? Chris, I just want to say, what happened back there in the shed? I know how hard that was. Josh was your friend. Actually, stop. No, I want to say, I mean, saving my life. Ash, what was I gonna do? Okay, I, I, I couldn't let anything happen to you. I couldn't. Ash, you all right? Yeah, I just, I know. You and Josh were close, Chris. Let's just find Sam, okay? That, that's what we're doing but I mean, now. oh my God. Ashley, I... just stop, okay? I don't want to think about what just happened. Chris. We're finding Sam. Did I see what? That, Chris, that! What that was that? It was like, it was like a see-through shape, like a ghost. Oh, boy. I'm serious. Why don't you believe me? I said I saw it. Doesn't that count for anything? We, we've been through hell tonight, okay? Your mind is fried. My mind is fried. I, I don't even trust what I've been seeing. No, you are wrong. I saw it, and I am sure, Chris. All right, all right. Maybe, maybe it's, maybe you did see something. Let's just, let's just keep our heads. Are we going crazy down here? It, it's, it's the only place left Sam could be, Ash. I wish we could just go find everyone else and- What if Sam needs us? What if she's in trouble? Oh, God. <laughs> let's go. into it, right? I mean, you're not into it. I don't think so. I mean, I don't know. How did everything get so freaky around here? Doors slamming and candles lighting up out of nowhere and that that specter or whatever Ashley, it was. I, I, I think you're kind of ignoring what's really happening here. Don't tell me you didn't see that translucent white figure just passing right by us. We, we, we could be seeing things. I'm not imagining things. Yeah, well, I, I mean, I saw things too. I, I, I saw what happened to Josh in the shed. You know, that, that's, that's what I'm worried about. Oh, Chris, I know. I know. You know what I'm really worried about? Okay, I'm worried about Sam. 
What, what, what's happened to her? If there's some maniac out here, then she... Wait! Chris, 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 the ghost! What? Didn't you see it? No. You were looking at your phone, you dip. What are you tweeting? Hashtag, there's a freaking ghost after us. Ash, calm down, okay? There is no ghost here. G ghost of what? You, you're freaked out because of what happened with Josh. You're not paying attention. I saw it. I saw a ghost, and it looked like Hannah. It looked wait, like wait, Hannah. Wait, 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 what? Her baby's bad. Jesus, Ash, what? <gasps> What, what do you think? They followed us up here from the seance? Oh, I don't know, maybe. They didn't, because ghosts don't exist, okay? Oh, okay, who was talking to us at the seance, Chris? I don't know. <laughs> what did that? How does a picture just jump off the wall like that? Oh my god! There! Look there, Chris! You can't tell me you didn't see well, that! That's, uh, see? That's uh You do see that, it! I don't know. I I I I just <laughs> this is fucking crazy. Chris, it's showing us the way. See what? It's tiny furniture? No. It's a whole scene with dolls and everything. Yeah. And look. This little key. What did I tell you? The ghost is helping us. Whoa, 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 whoa. What is going on here? Oh, God. It's... It's like... It's not like anything. That's us. <sighs> hiding there, waiting for Hannah. Last year. But it's it's so accurate. I mean, that's exactly where I was sitting, and that's where Matt was. This was set up by someone. Who was there? Or someone, or something that was watching us. Maybe it's a warning. I think someone... I think someone put this here to mess with us. No, it has to be the ghost. It's trying to tell us the maniac killed Hannah and Beth. I think it's this bastard that he's, he's here trying to fuck with our heads. Why would he set this all up, Chris? He's trying to tell us that he's gonna come after us all, too. Dice! Oh, 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 oh. It's... It's Hannah's diary. Everyone being together here on the mountain is going to be so awesome. Cozy fires and hot tubs and OMG, Mike, I am so psyched to spend some time with him. I can't read this. It's so sad, Chris. That'd make sense, I guess. I don't like being watched. Better? Go suck an egg. Now it's better. Hey. Hey, look at this. Doesn't seem as old as some of the stuff down here. It's a catalog for industrial light bulbs. That is so random. Look. 
One of the bulbs is circled. That's a powerful bulb. Huh. Just when you think it can't get any creepier. Oh! Jeez. Ah. I don't think I can take any more of this. Yeah, I'm, uh, I'm about at my limit here, too. All I wanted to do was forget last year ever happened and- To be honest, I'm not sure what Hannah thought she was doing. Yeah, well, you know how it is when you're crushing pretty hard on somebody. Great, so you're basically saying that we put a vulnerable friend in a terrible situation and essentially caused her to run away and never to be heard from again. If it was you, don't you think you would have run away? I mean, who likes being made fun of? <laughs> People don't make fun of me. To your face. What? Chris, we made her look so stupid in front of all of her friends and the guy she liked. I can't imagine doing anything worse to somebody. anyone make fake newspapers? <laughs> That's a really good question. You know what? No. Ash? No, I've had enough. I'm not going down any further into this nightmare, Chris. Ashley, I understand, okay? I'm really freaked out too, but if Sam's down there all alone with a maniac and we leave, we're basically killing her ourselves. I know, I know, I just, I don't think I can do it. <sighs> yeah, it's not looking good, huh? I'm really scared, Chris. I'm scared too, but I got your back, okay? As long as you got mine. I do. Um, yeah, so let's get this over with, I guess. Okay. Chris, I'm getting a really weird feeling from all of this. What do you mean? So we're saying that the same guy who made the newspapers also set up the camera, right? Yeah, I, I think so. It's just, it feels like he's constructing this whole story for us, then watching us run around, freaking out, seeing what we do, like it's like it's some sort of fucking experiment. Yikes, that, that's kind of, <laughs> yeah, that actually makes a weird sort of sense. Right?
surprise. Oh, boy. You think all this stuff is... is his? Unless the Washingtons were into some freaky shit in their spare time, then yeah, probably. Oh no, you've got to be kidding me! Repulse him! This can't be for Edith. Why the hell is that here? It's like a goddamn grindhouse movie in here. I mean, wait, what is this, like a fucking hit list? Christ. video she's just so so what she's so excited it's Hannah and alive hey, Hannah. she has no idea oh, oh geez oh my god she's well, here Cheryl. I forgot you were such oh a willful god. participant Matt what are you doing here yeah well we all were Hannah I'm sorry Hannah. You look like you were enjoying yourself. I didn't know what was going to happen. It was a dumb prank, Chris, and maybe we shouldn't have done it, but it's not like I personally made her run into the woods. Kind of splitting hairs a little. Look, she chose to do that. It's not our fault she did that. Slow down, okay? I can't handle this ghost and these videos and everything just, just lying Just calm down. Around. Listen to me for a what? second. What? Calm down? Why should I calm down, Chris? I am freaking this out right now. This has got to be someone messing with us. What? Think about it. Ghosts don't hook up video cameras. They don't play games. Then who would set this all up? Seriously, I'm asking. I don't know. Maybe the same person who tied you up and killed Josh? Yeah, right. The same person who might have Sam right now. Maybe you're right. I wish I wasn't. Oh, crap. Look at that. What? Might be Sam's. All right, let me see if I can get this. Yeah, I got it, but oh, damn, this thing is heavy. Be careful. You gotta come through, Ash. I, I can't hold it. Uh, oh, come on. Chris. Wait, to what? I think I just saw Sam over there. Uh, Ash, are you sure? I don't know, but come on. I think we should check it out. Uh, well, I'm pretty sure whoever's bleeding came through here, okay? So we really gotta get moving, like now. Okay. Okay, yeah, you're right. I'm coming. Uh. God, I thought this thing was gonna crush me. Come on. I don't get it. Why would anybody want to make this place any cooler? It's freezing. I don't know what goes on inside this guy's head, Nash.
Oh, Chris. Oh, no. Hello? Sam? Sam! I don't... Shit. I don't get it. It's a dummy. Yeah, no, I can see that. Why is it dressed up like Sam? I don't know. Why would someone dress up a dummy like Sam? Chris, I don't know, and I'm kind of freaking out. Where the hell is Sam? This is crazy. This is crazy. <laughs> 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 off. <laughs> what is this? This is, no, Chris. this is the guy who killed Josh. No, God. No, God. You murdered a piece of shit? You oh, monster! Look We're gonna die, Chris. I don't think I'm ready to die. No one is going to die. I wish I could tell you. It's just not fair. What? Tell me what? It's too late. Chris, what's the point? Stop it. Just say. We're always talking around it. And now, I mean, we've wasted everything. Ashley, none of it was wasted. What do you mean? Every second that I spent with you was the only thing I ever wanted to do with my time. <laughs> what are you saying, Chris? I'm sorry. I, I should have told you how I felt. God, Chris. Ashley, no. I swear when we get out of this... Oh, God! No. Ashley, I'll get you out of this! I won't let you die! Hello there, my special little subjects. So oh, shit. Here, Chris. Don't be scared. Oh, you should be, Ash. Because here's the twist. Chris has made one fatal choice already today. And now, he must make another. Chris... You can take that gun in front of you and shoot Ashley, or you can shoot yourself. Whoever is left can live. The choice is yours. <laughs> Don't be so silly, Chris. Let me choose to save you. If I do one last thing in my life, let me do this. Chris, please. Oh, oh God. No. Don't you see? Huh? Don't you see that this torture porn has gone too far? Huh? Now what gives you the right to play God in these people's lives? What makes you so special then? Huh? You're sick! You're a sick fuck! What the hell have you done to them? Huh? What the hell have you done to them? Psychopath. Psychopath. Wow, this is weird. Come on! Hello? Sam? Ah! 
Oh God! Chris, the choice is yours. Hello. Oh God, we need help, please. joining me. Tonight, we're going to conduct a little experiment. Hello? Hello, children. No, that's not right. <clears throat> Greetings, pilgrims. Holy shit. Mike, what are you doing? 
down there, there's a... Oh my, thank God you found me. It's okay. Okay, you okay? Oh my gosh, your fingers, Mike. Yeah. Yeah, and I'm the lucky one. Jesus, what happened? There's some fucking maniac up here on the mountain. He's... He's trying to kill us all. Listen, this guy who you're talking about, he attacked me. He showed me these videos too. And one of them showed Josh being killed. Just ripped apart by this huge fucking saw blade. Jesus Christ. And Mike, I think somehow Josh is involved in all of this. Wait, what? How? I'm really not sure, but there was a message from his doctor and it mentioned a plan that was like a bad idea and now he's dead. What the fuck is going on around here? There's a door here. It won't open. Can you unlock it from your side? What are you doing? Well, actually, the towel didn't turn out to be the best outfit for fighting off killer maniacs, you know? Do you mind, Mike? Oh, uh, right. My bad. Okay. I'm into that. What's that? Is that crying? No! No, no, no! Get away! Oh, Chris. Chris, 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 Chris. What the fuck? You've heard of blanks before. I mean, really? Oh, God. Here goes 600 bucks. 
Better be worth it, I look great in that top. All right, now we're talking. Busted elevator's my only way out.
Weird. Really weird. On for fuck's sake. Son of a bitch. <laughs> Shit.
lovely. Danger is my middle fucking name. down here. And after all you've been through, good, 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 good. I mean, how does that feel, right? How does it feel? Do you enjoy feeling terrorized, humiliated? I mean, panicked? 
all those emotions that my sisters got to feel once one year ago. Only, only guess what? They didn't get to laugh it off. No, 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 no. They're gone. I don't know if you noticed this, Josh, but none of us are laughing. Oh, come, 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 come. Why the long faces? Come on. It's good to get the heart racing every now and then, right? And race they did. I mean, every one of you just pitter pat, pitter pat. I hope you appreciated my little phantasmagorical spectacle. I mean, <laughs> no detail too small. Did that just no happen? opportunity missed. It was such a delight to play the puppet master to to all of your Pavlovian panic. <laughs> and all that gore, gore, there was gore galore, fake bodies. I mean, God, that shit was expensive. And no retakes. Nope, nope, nope. Only double takes. Oh, you should have seen your faces. Hook, line, and sinker for every little stinker. <laughs> Josh, your fingerprints were all over this. It was obviously you. Oh, really? Really, really, really? You're crying out for help, Josh. Come on, you wanted to get caught, didn't you? Oh, sure. I'm totally just crying out for help. Help me. Oh, help me, help, help. Come on. Come on, it was just for fun. I mean, so you got a little bit of egg on your face, right? Nobody got hurt. What are you talking about, you asshat? Jessica's fucking dead. What? Did you hear me? Jessica is dead. You are gonna fucking pay, you ah! dick! Ah! Guys! Guys, come on. Seriously, this is crazy, you know? Shut up. Why'd you hit her, man? Huh? Why'd you have to fucking hit her? Ah! What are you talking you about? You punched Ashley, you piece of shit! Mm. Oh. I got so mad. You don't hit a girl. You, you just don't. Dude, dude, Chris, bro, I... And I'm not your bro. Where are we going? Where are you guys taking me? Locking you up, bro. What? You can't do anything stupid before we call the police in the morning. Come on. I didn't do anything. Are you serious, bro? Goddamn murderer is what you are. I didn't do it. Michael, please just listen to me, man. I did not hurt Jessica. You know what, man? You need to shut up. Chris, hey. Come on, Coach. He's, we're partners. Stop. Don't say that. Oh, fine. Be a dick. You only see what you want to see. You're not fine. You are fine. Ah, dude. Ah, it's not my fault. You suckers can't take a joke. Oh, oh, wait. Did I hurt you? Did you just. You feel a little, a little bit of pain? Mm. Right now, I am so, so ah! sorry! Stop it! Jesus, dude. Stop! Michael, I'm sorry, man. I can't tell you how sorry I am that something happened to Jessica, but I swear, I swear to you, I have no idea what happened to her. Shut the fuck up, Josh. You can't talk your way out of this one. <laughs> but can't we all just get along? <laughs> ah! Damn it! <clears throat> Not dicking around. <laughs> Not how it's supposed to go down. <clears throat> You're just a bunch of bullies. You can't hang out a, a guy just to try like this, guys. Huh? Not like, not like you got the guts to really do anything about it anyways. Ah! Ah! Really, really, really need to shut up, man. Oh. Oh, oh that, that's... I, I, I mean, I, I, I don't even know what you mean because I, I don't have anything to regret. Oh my God. Ah! Yeah! Ah! Yeah! 
Okay, time me up now, okay? Stay still, All right. man. Right, 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 still. Okay. Can't tie him up if they just wiggle around. Gosh, dude. I leave me a little wiggle room, huh? What does it take to shut you up? Oh, not so tight, okay? Not so tight, okay? Get a wiggle room now. Those plastic ties, that's where it's... What? In God's name, is he plastic plastic talking plastic about? This is hard to watch. You ever see this kind of shit before? Oh, I've never, never seen him like this. Money back. <laughs> Everybody's stupid. Stupid, stupid, stupid. Chris and Ash. Chris is an ass. Ashley's a dumb dumb. <laughs> I, I'm sorry, what did you say? Well, I said you're a dummy, dummy. <laughs> what is wrong with you? Oh, Ashley. Oh. Ashley, I'll get you out of this. I won't let you die. Oh, I never imagined in my wildest dreams that you liked me. Stop. <laughs> You know what that sound is? It's the sound of never kissing Ashley, you pussy! Stop! Yeah, you know, you might as well let Ashley sleep with Mike. I mean, at least he's got some notches in his belt, you know? He'll treat her right! You're fucking pathetic, Christopher! I'm gonna beat his head off! Don't listen to him! Not worth it! Hey, Mike! Mike, 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 Mike. Mike! What? What happened? With Jess, Mike? You know what happened. No. No, I... I don't. I got a problem, Mike. I don't remember killing Jess. Jesus Christ. No, I mean, like, I feel like I, I would remember killing her, you know? She's so soft. And she's probably got, like, a really tight bod. Shut your fucking mouth! Seriously? What, what? Did you think I was gonna shoot him? I, I don't know. Come on, Chris. You know me better than that. Yeah, Chris. You know me better than that. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Well, just next time, give me a heads up, all right? Oh, oh, you poor little piggies. You can't even get your good cop, bad cop routine to work. Leave it to the pros, bros! Why don't you go back to the lodge? Make sure everything's all right. I'll we'll stay here with this lunatic until the morning. Oh, sleep over. Can we order pizza? <laughs> you sure you're okay? Yeah. The one I know everything's fine back there. Yeah, you're right. See you in the morning. Josh. <laughs> Josh! How does it feel? Do you enjoy all those emotions that my sisters got to feel once, one year ago? Only, only guess what? They didn't get to laugh it off. No! Nope! No, no, no! They're gone! Jessica's fucking dead! What? Did you hear me? Jessica is dead. And you were gonna fucking pay, you ah! dick! What happened with Jess, Mike? I don't remember killing Jess. Christ. Oh, God. Oh, my God, Matt!
is gonna be the way. Are you all right? I didn't think that I'd make it. You were screaming bloody murder. Are you okay? You look totally lost. There was something. Where is that? Come sit down, sit down. Something's out there. Did you guys split up? A monster? Wait. Monster. What are you talking about? I said there's something out like there. Like what? Ash, relax. It was Josh. It was all Josh. No, 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 no. Listen to we me. We got him tied up. He can't hurt you. No, it was after me and it wasn't human. Hold on. Wait, Em. Where's Matt? Is he okay? I don't want to talk about that fucking sack of shit. Wow. He left me. He just fucking abandoned me when I was hanging off that goddamn tower about to die. What tower? And then I, I fell into this terrifying freaking mine shaft and he was just gone. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What, what mine shaft? I, I was walking down there in the mines and it was dark and I found this pile and there was Beth's head. Wait, what? Beth's head. I found oh it. Oh my god. What the fuck? Are you serious? Yes, I'm serious. I think they fell down there. Oh, Jesus Christ. But the worst part is I don't think that Hannah died, like, from the fall, not right away. Wait, what? What do you mean? I don't know. I feel like she was down there, like, starving to death for weeks when we were all up here looking for her, and we had no idea. Jeez, that's horrible. Listen, in in the tower there was there was a radio and and I got through to someone, but then that was right when the tower collapsed. Em, you made it. Oh God, yeah, yeah, Mike. <sighs> what about Matt? We're trying to figure that out. Yeah, and then there was this monster that was chasing her. I... She's all messed up, guys. 
Emily. Hey, Em. Whoa. Who the fuck can that be? Josh. Jess? It's not Jess. Sorry, man, but who is it? I don't know. We should check it out. I got your back. Good. Door. You ready? Mm -hmm. You ready? Just do it already. Whoever it is is probably gone by now. I, unless you want me to take the gun. No, no, no. I think that's less good. You do the door. I got the gun. <laughs> Hold on there. Hold on there, mister. Freeze. Ah, oh, what? All right, all right. Just... Take it easy, Grandpa. Okay, everybody, just calm down. Now, nah, just move over there. Go on, move. Let me say what I came to say. I'm here to tell you what you're up against being back on this mountain. You should never have returned. I don't know why you did after what happened last year. You mean with Hannah and Beth? Yeah, how could you know without being involved? Our responsible. You hold on to your horses. I don't take kindly to you kids coming up here to my mountain. Your mountain? Huh? I'm sure the Washingtons would be very surprised to hear that. <laughs> well, the mountain don't belong to me, it's true. But it don't belong to the Washingtons. This mountain belongs to the Wendigo. <laughs> Who? What's he talking about? Who the hell's a Wendigo? Let's hear him out. Not like we have a choice. Now, I'm only gonna tell you this once. It doesn't matter to me if you believe it or not. I got reasons I want to get it off my chest. See? I told you. He's guilty as shit. Guilty as something. Shut up, Mike. There is a curse that dwells in these mountains. Should any man or woman resort to cannibalism in these woods, the spirit of the Wendigo shall be unleashed. Oh, crap. You're gonna need to find somewhere safe. The basement might be okay. Okay, get down there now, all of you, and wait. What? Why? For how long? Until dawn. Guys, I ran off and left Josh when I heard screaming. Where did you leave him? In the shed. Uh, your friend will already be dead. No. No, he can't be. We, we were just with him. A lot can happen quickly on this mountain. No. I'm gonna go get him. You can't go out there, Chris. I'm supposed to be his best friend, and, and, and I let him down. No, he let you down, Chris. He let all of us down. I don't care. I'm going to get him. Then I'll go with you. I, I don't need your help. You're going alone. It's suicide. Fine. The rest of you, get down to the basement. Be safe. And don't go outside again until we're back. You don't seem to understand the magnitude of the situation. Well, I'm going to get Josh, aren't I? No, I'm going to get Josh. You're going to help me. Do you understand? Uh, yeah, I think so. You need to follow me and do everything I tell you. This is the end. You point towards the thing you want to kill. I know how to use a shotgun, man. No, you don't. What? How do you know? <sighs> Trust me. I know. Hey. Come back safe. Come on. We need to hurry, son. I, uh... See you soon. So, so, so tell me, you're the expert on these things. What's, uh, what, what's the guy got to know? You just be careful. You follow my lead. 
So, how many times do I have to shoot it with the shotgun before it's dead? Well, you'll be shooting it a long time. You, you mean this thing won't even kill it? No, but it'll slow it down. Well, how do you kill it? They don't like fire. I don't like fire. They fear it. And it can kill them, if you have to. See, their skin is like... It's like tough armor. Unless you burn it off first. It's gross. Well, what, what are these things like? I mean, are they just crazy unpredictable, or... I mean, can you figure out what they're gonna do? Well, they adhere to some patterns. Like any animal. Or human. You mean, like how? Like they've got schedules? Well, they only hunt at night. Oh. Why? I didn't ask. Any, uh, pro Wendigo tips? Like if I rub garlic all over me, they wouldn't be able to smell me or something? Oh, they'll still smell you. Anything like that? I can't see you if you're standing still. It's like toads. <laughs> Sight is based on changes of movement in their field of vision. So if I don't move, I, I'm, I'm basically invisible. Yeah. Well, I wouldn't recommend testing it out. Unless you have no other choice. Josh, he could still be out there. <laughs> First, the wind you go. He'll render you immobile. And then he strips the skin off of your entire body, piece by piece. And then he keeps you alive and aware and feasts on your organs, one piece at a time. So the launch then. Ask, ask. Oh, thank God, please. Let 
Let me in, quick! What happened? We gotta, we gotta go. That thing was like right behind me. Ah! Go, 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 go! Oh my god, guys, thank god. It took you so long. It's not so good up there right now. Understatement of the night. Chris, where's the flamethrower guy? Uh, yeah, he, uh... He didn't make it? No. What happened? The thing, it, uh, tore him apart. Right in front of me. Oh, God. All right. These are all the doors? Yeah. Are you sure? What are you looking for? Another way out. Mike, look, I really don't think that's a good idea. We should stay put right here until dawn. At least we're safe down here. Oh, yeah? All wrapped up like a little present with a bow on top for that thing to tear us apart on Christmas morning? People will come for us in the morning. You don't sound so sure. That is what'll happen, right, Em? Yeah, I, I mean, right? Well, you can wait. I'm leaving. Mike, there's no key for the cable car. Josh, he's gotta have it. Josh? One of his dirty little tricks. Great, great. If that fucking thing got a hold of Josh, then... We're shit out of luck. I don't know, Mike. It's possible. What's possible? It may have taken him down to the mine. What? I saw some horrible stuff down there. I think it's where that thing lives, and... Huh. Em? What? Fuck it. I'm gonna get that key right from that thing's goddamn bedroom, and then I'm gonna get us all the hell out of here. And what is all that? It's uh, that old guy's bag. Is that a map? <gasps> that guy was prepared for anything. <laughs> Not quite. What is this place? Oh, my God. Wait, wait, wait. What is that? I was down there. It was horrible. You were? You've been a cave-in in the 50s, I guess, and these miners got trapped down there. Oh, my God. Some of them survived, but, like, 15 of them didn't make it. There was this reporter, and I think he figured out there had been some, like, big cover-up going on. I found these plans. They knew the mine was a death trap, but they let the miners keep working anyway. And I'm not sure what it means, but I found this chair. Dried blood all over the place, like somebody had been tortured. Michael, I'd like to maybe focus on how we're going to get the fuck out of here, please. I'm just saying, it's weird how much crazy shit's gone on up here. What's weird is that there's a tunnel leading from the lodge to the sanatorium, see? That's how I got back here. I saw this when I was down there. That's where it lives. Em? Em, what is... Huh? What is that? Ash. Em, oh my god, oh my god, it's, oh it's my nothing. god. It's oh nothing. No, it just, it, no, it no, bit no, me and... It bit you? What bit you? The... The Wendigo. What? It's nothing, really. It's not a big deal. You okay? Shit. It doesn't hurt anymore, really. It's it's not that bad. Em, if that thing bit you... I, I know what you're thinking, and I'm fine. Are you? Yes. Emily, at least let us check it out. Emily, if the Wendigo bit you, you could turn into one of those things. Oh, that's ridiculous. He said it was from eating each other. Remember, he said oh, that. Is that how it works? Yes. It happens if it bit you, you're gonna turn into one and then you're gonna turn on us. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god! You can't be down here with us. What? Mike! You gotta go. Are you kidding me? You're putting us all in danger. Like hell I am! Emily, you can't stay here. <laughs> Mike, just cool your head, okay? We don't know if it works like that. Maybe it's just a bite. I've seen what these fuckers can do, and I don't wanna say it again. What is this? Guys, what are you doing? Door's right here. I am letting you do this voluntarily. Oh no, you're just making yourself feel better about sending me to my death since you know there's a Wendigo out there ready to rip me to pieces like it did with- Okay, oh my god, will you just go? Go, get out of here! Whoa, okay. Whoa, 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 Mike, calm down. You're, you're gonna shoot me? <laughs> Like me? This is the safe room, M. 
quickly. It is not safe as long as you're in it. No. Not for us. Don't, don't do that. I'm really sorry. Okay, it's over, it's over. Uh. You guys are safe. You guys are safe. It's a safe room, guys. I had to do it. I had to do it. Okay, I'm gonna get the key from Josh. I'll, uh, I'll come back here. You guys are safe. It's over. Hey, what happened out there? You don't want to know. Hey, are you okay? He was right there. What, the flamethrower dude? Yeah, the, the weird guy. He got himself killed. Was it the Wendigo? Yeah. No, he was definitely not lying about that. Oh, Jesus. What did it look like? Like, 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 like a, like a person, only... But just d distorted somehow. This guy's a little OCD. There's a lot of history to this. This says that because the Wendigos are mutated from humans, when they hunt us, they know how to perfectly mimic their prey. What does it say? It says that the bites, it, if it bites you, it's not infectious. It doesn't do anything. Let me see that. Listen to me. Because of your choices, people have died. I don't know which is worse, actively triggering events that lead to someone's death, or passively allowing a tragedy to occur. Because you couldn't lift a goddamn finger to help someone else. Remember last year, huh? Uh, you left your poor sisters to die. You did nothing to help them. Paralyzed by your own self-centered fear. While a real threat was closing in. No, it's all about you, John. It's always all about you. You're kidding. 
game has gone terribly wrong. And your friends, like your sisters, have deserted you. You're all alone. Can you feel how cold your loneliness has become, huh? Why did you hurt them? Joshua, why did you hurt them? Oh, but of course you did. They were your friends, you misled them, you lied to them, and you put them through a night of genuine horror. Let's hope that it's not too late for atonement. And that your friends, if they still are your friends, can save you from this terrible isolation. Long. It's not so good up there right now. Uh, he's gone. We're too late. Shh, quiet. Uh, yeah, he, uh... Wait! No more. Holy shit! What the... What are you looking for? Another way out. Mike, there's no key for the cable car. Josh, he's gotta have it. And what is all that? It may have taken him down to the mine. I was down there. It was horrible. You've been a cave in in the 50s, I guess, and these miners got trapped down there. Um, what is that? Huh? This is the safe room, M. Please. Oh. Oh. Holy shit, Mike! Oh shit, what the fuck did I just do? I gotta get the key from Josh. I'll, uh, I'll come back here. I just need a pitchfork and a mob.
Happy to see me again, huh? Hey. I was hoping I'd run into you again. All right. Good boy. All right, pal. You're coming with me. All right. Here's the plan. I happen to see a map of this place, so we're not flying blind. There should be a way through the psychiatric wing that'll take us right outside the mine. Think you can handle that? Couldn't have said it better myself. Ah, boy. I can move like you, Wolfie. I'm stuck on this side. All right. There goes another. Awesome. See that? Do got moves. Don't I, Wolfie? Built like tanks. How crazy were these inmates? Fuck, man. This is truly disgusting.
is going on around here? Sauce Christmas cake. This is fucking unbelievable. Where are you? 
Time, boys. It's enough for me for all ya. Buddy. Come on down. It's all right. Not the dopey, bud. Hey, I'll catch you on the flip side, huh?
I'm kind of gimping out here, guys. Uh, I think maybe you should go on without me. Oh, God, Chris, are you going to be okay? Yeah, yeah, just go, go on. I, I, I can't keep up with you macho ladies. Oh, God, Chris, just stop it, okay? Listen, just, just go on ahead, okay? You got to warn Mike. I'll be right behind you. I'm just going to take a breather. All right. No, Chris, we are not leaving you. We're sticking together. Mike will just have to wait. <sighs> Should we try it? Well, it's not like we got a whole lot of choices here. Okay, this is maybe the last place I would want to be right now. So who's going first? It's not so bad. You think this is the tunnel to the sanatorium? Of course it is. Where else would it go? Chris, I know you're hurt, but you gotta move it, all right? I'm trying, Ash. Mm. Hey, um, hey, we should close this, right? Huh? I mean, what if something's following us? Yes, fine, close it, but we gotta keep moving. Can you just catch up, please? Yeah.
Who's there? Anybody? Jessica! Is it you? This is fucking crazy. Jessica. Ugh! Jessica, is that you? God, I am so glad to see you. Glad you're safe. Look. Look there. Wow, great. <gasps> the ladder's toast. We're never gonna make it up there. No, 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 I think I can. I think I can do it. It's like a rock wall. I'm gonna keep going. You should head back to the lodge. I've gotta get Mike. Good luck.
Holy shit! Shit! Marshmallows? Find a way down to where this fucker lives. Emily! Mike, there's no key for the cable car. Josh, he's gotta have it. Oh, he's gone. We're too late. Shh, quiet. It may have taken him down to the mine. Wait! Don't move. Holy shit! What the fuck? I'm gonna get that key right from that thing's goddamn bedroom, and then I'm gonna get us all the hell out of here. That's it. That's it. Come on! Come on! Let's go! Run! Let's find a way down to where this fucker lives. I'm gonna leave you now, Josh. It's time you learn. There's more to be afraid of that can be dreamt up by the unhinged imagination of a self-indulgent, spoiled little brat! You had so many people who cared about you, who were willing to help! But at every turn, you choose to push them away, and now you're all alone. by the sounds of things, you won't be alone for long. No, you won't be alone for long. Deep breaths, Josh. Deep breath.
Yeah. I want to start my fucking life. I'll take orders from you. You can't. You can't tell me what to do. You can't tell me what to do anymore. Oh, okay. Okay. I trust you. I trust you. I trust you. You're all alone down there. No, 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 not again. All alone. But you're with us now. Family. Get away from me! Get away! Why didn't you save us, Josh? Why did you want us to die? I didn't want you to die. I swear. these old pictures of some guys with that scar, and he was transforming into a Wendigo. You're kidding. It's one of the miners who'd been trapped back in the 50s in the cave-in, which means that thing is 80 years old. At least. Spunky for an old-timer. They cleaned the place out. Killed a lot of people. They? You mean there are more of them? Oh, yeah. How many? Too many. I think we're close to the lair. How can you tell? I don't know. I just feel really terrible all of a sudden. Did I? I really don't want to go in there. There's no other way through. Okay. You need like 
There weren't any sharks or anything in here. Sharks? Great. Thank you. survive anymore. If someone finds this, I'm sorry. I had to. I had no choice. What does it mean? Jesus. So what? What does that mean? So Hannah must have buried her. God damn it. God damn it. Hannah was down here. I don't believe any of this! She would have been starving. She would have been desperate. Fuck! We need to find Josh. Right now. Tripping or something. Josh! M M Mike. Josh! Hey, man. Oh, don't, don't hit me, please. please. Well, you were deep in it, man. Full mental jacket. We didn't think we'd get you back. Josh, Hannah was down here for weeks, a month. She dug us up. Sam. Mike. Hey, let's just get the fuck out of here. Okay. Josh, do you have the key for the cable car? Uh, yeah. See that over there? That means there's a direct way out. Come on. Yeah. 
And there's no way Josh is gonna make it up there. Okay. If you help me up, I can go back to tell the others we're okay. Yeah. Yeah, good. You bring Josh back the way we came, and we'll all meet at the lodge. Be careful. Yeah, you too. All right, let's go, you fucked up son of a bitch. You didn't, you didn't have to hit me so much, man. Uh, yeah, um, I'm sorry about before, man. I, I thought you killed Jess. I was wrong. you end up down here? Mike and I were... We were messing around and... And then it... It was... What? I don't... I don't know. I was by the window and there was all this glass and it was in the snow and then it was moving so fast. Fuck. And then I was um, just down here. Oh, God. Can you move? Yeah. Come on, Jess.
不出来。Come on, Jess.
You look terrible. Gonna look worse if we stay out here. Come on. How do you rate our chances of survival? Hmm? I'm trying not to think about it. Oh! Run! Go, go, go! Run! Run!
visual. The main structure is completely destroyed. Over. Oh, hold on. I'm seeing something. It looks like there are survivors. Let's pick them up. Uh, the old man, I, uh, <laughs> I, I don't know how to describe him, I mean... You said you thought he was stalking you at first. Did anyone else in your group think that? Well, yeah, we... <laughs> Is it possible they could have killed him? What? No. No, you, you, you don't understand. Don't you understand? And if he attacked you... He saved my life. And I watched him die. I heard Jessica. I don't know how or why she was down there, but I know I heard her. I was right there, and I could have done something. I tried to do something. It wasn't good enough. How did you end up in the mines? I was... Carried and um, taken and... What did you see? I don't know. I don't... I don't know. He was out of his fucking mind. He wanted to hurt us. Okay? And... I thought he was the one who attacked Jess. I thought we were close. After his sisters. Disappeared, he'd come and talk to me. He said I was the only one who understood him. I thought... I thought we had a connection. If you need someone to talk to... I'm fine. Sometimes, after a traumatic experience... I said I'm fine. I... I stabbed him and I tried to get away, but I didn't know. I swear I didn't know didn't know? Who did you stab? Oh, I, I, I stabbed the maniac. I didn't know it was Josh, but then he was the psycho. And how was I supposed to know Josh had all the sauce and the gun and oh my God. She was shot. What? She was what? Is she okay? We recovered her body with a gunshot wound to the head. No. No, 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 no. No, no, it doesn't make any, it doesn't make any sense. It was somebody else. It had to be. Your friend Ashley, she told us she tried to help you. <sighs> she said she heard you calling out. <sighs> Not me. Is there something you want to tell us? No. No. No, I... It... So it was you who no. broke up with her? It's... Okay. Okay, uh, you can understand. These things, um, they were, okay, they, they were confused. And, and the circumstances were not normal. You had a fight. You were angry. Yeah, no, yes, yes, but no, okay? Okay, it wasn't like that. What was it like, Michael? <sighs> she was... <sighs> she was infected, okay? And, and, and we thought she'd turn into one. So, so, um, what was I supposed to do? You know, I, I had to stop her. I had, I had to keep her from changing. Mike. What do you remember? He came for me. He did. Came for you? Where is he? Did he make it? You need to listen to me. I don't care if you believe me or not. It doesn't matter because you will. You need to go down to the mines. What's in the mines, Sam? 
I've seen what's down there, and I'd give anything to unsee it.
Is that? Oh, fuck. Stay back! Stay back! No, no! Stay back! <laughs> 